Do you remember this little shoot? Oh, yeah. It's a high school senior, Noah Van Boren. The student who has Down syndrome was overjoyed to be accepted to Edgewood College. The school has a special integrated program at the small Madison Private College. Fox 11's Kelly Schlick shows us how this program is making a difference for kids like Noah. Noah Van Buren and his parents, Todd and Kara, are still reeling from this moment. Yes! I've got goosebumps now. I was shaking coming into the house because I knew our future was in this envelope. My mom's starting to have tears. I'm so happy for you. This was the moment Noah found out he was going to college. Yes! I was kind of wishing maybe not because I don't want him to leave. You know, I mean, it's a, it's a fear. Van Voren has Down syndrome, but the Little Shoot senior always kept goals beyond high school. It's great exciting to go to Edgewood. Um, Edgewood is a really, really good campus. I like going down there. It's the best time. And he knows that his friends are going to go to college, and he, he never for a minute didn't think he was going. And so as parents, when you hear those things from your kids, you do everything you can to figure out how to make that happen for them. Now that their oldest child is off to college in the fall, his parents are still choked up. Not just from the acceptance letter, but from the warm reactions across the country to the video. As a man, this is why <laughs> right here. It's, it's emotional, you know. It's up and down, up and down. It's, I can't, uh, you know, you're supposed to be the tough guy, but it's, it's, it's unbelievable. I never realized that this would happen. I really don't. But it did. However, the Van Vorens say many people are surprised their son can go to college. And they don't know how yeah. it works, and they have lots of questions yeah. um, because they didn't know kids like Noah could have this opportunity. We went to Edgewood College to learn about cutting edge. This class looks like any other. Today, we're going to talk primarily about... Um, Nonverbal learning disabilities. That's because the classes at Edgewood are fully integrated with the special needs students. It's the only college in Wisconsin to offer this kind of program. More and more adults now have lived with individuals with disabilities and gone to school with them. So this is just the next level. This is where we need to take it next because if students are going to change from students to participating adults, we want them to have jobs. And in order to get jobs, you need training. Cutting Edge co-founder Courtney Moffitt says the program admits 20 students a year with an essay and interview process. Once accepted, students may audit classes or take them for credit. They can earn a Cutting Edge program certificate, a two-year program certificate, or a four-year degree. Sophomore Kathleen Coogan is one of the Cutting Edge program's success stories. She dreams of being an artist. I'm hoping I can work on the art business and get most out of that, um, maybe some more looking around for more jobs. I was hoping I could be working in Starbucks, I'm, you know, in the community. In addition to art, Coogan has taken safety courses, working towards independence. I live off campus, so I, I walk every morning. I get up on time and get to classes, and I've been so independent. It's fun being independent, too. But cutting-edge students aren't completely on their own. We have peer mentors for everyone that's going to be living either on campus or in an apartment. So we have some apartments that are cutting edge apartments where we integrate them with individuals without disabilities. That was the selling point for us when, they, when we realized that they knew that young adults with disabilities needed more relationships than paid relationships in their lives. That was when we were sold. We knew that it would be a great fit for him. Yet the Van Vorens still have some reservations. My parents are scared. We depended on each other, you know, for so long and now it's going to be, you know, one less. Current students have some advice for Noah. Start out slow and try it out and see how you feel. And it's going to be overwhelming sometimes. And the Van Vorens say their son is ready for the challenge. It's a pretty positive guy. That's what makes him unique. Well, it's going to be tough, but, uh, but he's got the, the willing to do it, you know. Like his shirt says, unstoppable. Kelly Schlicht, Fox 11 News.